Hey guys, it's Naeem bringing you real reactions and real responses. Now today I'm going to be reacting to Family Guy Roasting Every Woman. Now you know this is going to get a bit spicy. So if you want to see more reaction videos, especially Family Guy, yeah, subscribe and like, smash it. It really helps me out if you do that, by the way. So, right, three, two, one. Peter, you're not still friends with that idiot after what he did. Well, I mean, that may be a little harsh. I'm not going to avoid Peter like a idiot. drunk chick at a party. I mean, I don't go to like parties or whatever. I mean, I, I'm, it's here, I just read basically all day. Does that actually happen? Say that down in the below in the comments. Does that actually happen? Well, it hasn't been easy. Between doing the laundry and vacuuming, I barely had time to put on a nice sweater and clasp a cup of tea with two hands. Hey, man. By the way, I got like a candle, so... I do that. I mean, is that a women thing? And now I'm gonna tie this sweater around my waist and walk around the neighborhood. Hang on, I'll be right oh, back. Oh, that's like a soccer ball. Across the street. Peter, you can't keep using Cleveland's bathroom. Oh my god, yes I can. Cleveland's bathroom is the greatest discovery since fat women discovered Diet Coke. That reminds me, when I went to uh, um, um, uh, a shop with a friend, yeah, a restaurant, um, in essence, I, he bought me like a Max, Pepsi Max, yeah, and I wanted Diet, diet Pepsi or something. I assumed Diet Pepsi was sugar free. Apparently, Pepsi Max is the one that's a diet one. So, I mean, that happened to me as well. I can eat anything. It's just complicated, that's all. No, Brenda, it's not complicated. Trying to get a straight answer out of a 23-year-old girl is complicated. So do you want to go true. out sometime? So uh, like true. Go out or hang out or just do something. Like a date. Like a date date or like a date. Well, again, it depends on like yeah, who. Sure, maybe. I don't know. Yes, there are some girls who I think. My phone number, email me. Boy, this is fun, eh? <laughs> like so image. Like sit next to that woman who came with her co-workers. Huh, aren't we all pals? I work at the oh, office. Man. This is empowering. Maybe I'll get a dance, huh? You guys are probably going to be talking about this That's... forever. A woman who's so cool with all of this? Jackpot! That's so sad. Well, it's probably the right move anyway. Those girls seem kind of annoying. Look at them over there, taking a group picture together. I love you. I love you. It cringes the heck out of me, man. You can tell by the way we're pressing our faces I just I cringe it. I don't know, man. Like, guys... We just like we don't where care. Fat girls come from. So we were supposed to go to the library to wipe boogers in fancy books. I like to wipe mine in Bronte novels. It's like a time bomb to gross out lonely chicks. Oh, hmm. Heathcliff. Oh, come. Again, that reminds me. I was in W. H. Smith. It was a, a shop. Yeah, a bookshop, stationery shop. Now, I it was. I just picked a random book. I think it must have been like Game of Thrones. I have. Exclaimer, I haven't read nor watched Game of Thrones. Um, so I just flicked through it. I was thinking whether I was going to buy it. And then randomly, I see a tenner, £10. Now, I took it because it's not technically stealing, is it? It's like someone deliberately placed it there. It's not like you accidentally leave £10 in a book. Someone deliberately placed it in the middle of a book. So I took the tenner, which was interesting. Definitely not a bogey, though. I want so little. Oh, wow. You are definitely not afraid of dessert. You know, I wish I were secure enough to throw on any old thing and call it an outfit. Come Another on, cringe moment, so man. Much body confidence. I mean, who wouldn't with those <laughs> strong legs? So muscular. Hey, I like your tie. Thanks. Hey, 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 for real, for real. This is legit. I, like most of my friends who I compliment, or just guys in general, like we can just say legit. Li literally just a few words and that's enough um we don't go over the top about it um of course uh, this is an exaggeration not all not all women are like that but it's just uh, when i see a, a friend i haven't seen in a while i could basically say just to compliment him nice haircut man and that's it i don't have to go uh crawling through trenches just to make a compliment <laughs> Peter, why don't you just sit in that booth over there? Oh, man, that's where the after-work secretaries sit. What about Mr. Jemerson? Is he single? I, I, I don't know. What about Mr. Adler? Is, that... Is he single? 
I don't know who do that people is. do that? Well, do you know who is no, no, I know, like, uh, people... I'm assuming you? Oh, oh, hey, look, Kate. <laughs> Damn the burn. Uh, excuse me, can I get directions to the Providence Civic Center? <laughs> okay, I'm guessing do this is like out of cake? context. Yes. Do you like my ass? Yes. I mean, you can't see her ass, my so. ass. What kind of cake? Angel food cake. Well, Rusty, looks like we're gonna eat our way out of another oh, jam. Man. I gotta know if we should take 24 or 495. Hang on. I don't drive, which is a shame. Exit's coming up. <laughs> Half a mile. I swear that. <laughs> You'd think I could find it. Yeah, yeah, I would. I would. Okay, I'm taking 495. Oh, man. Uh, Here it is. It says take 24 to 128. Uh, as legit funny. But to be fair, he's still like Women, we've spent straight. decades fighting for our changed. right to vote. So when you go to those booths and cast your ballot, remember Warren G. Harding is way the cutest. <laughs> They've all got short hair as well. Like. And then we have a chocolate chocolate cake that's infused with chocolate, served with chocolate ice cream and a molten chocolate topping. We'll have one of those with four spoons. More like four of those with one spoon I mean, spoon for me. they look like slim fit women and they're going crazy for chocolate, really. Okay. Okay. We've got cannibalism here. Oh, can I just try a little sample? Oh, sample. So bad. Uh, so sure. bad. You gonna buy a cookie this time? Oh, I better just stick with the sample. I mean, I'm so bad. I'm one of them, like, if they give out free stuff on the street, I probably won't even take it. Unless it's probably, like, coffee-related, maybe. But, you know, sometimes they give free juices and stuff. And free, like, outside of Starbucks, they might give a free sort of, um, not cappuccino, or a bit of food or restaurant even. They might give a little. I don't even take that. I don't know why. It just feels weird to, like, take food and know in advance you're not going to pay for it of course in terms of restaurants like you can't expect to go to a friend's house and be at least i know i'm bad so that makes me a little less bad or worse that was the right thing to do peter damn hey tyler are you on your way to algebra yeah i'll see you there This is, this actually happened to me, man. Like, the miscommunication I have with some girls, yeah. Um, I, I'm not saying girls are confusing. It's just the ones that don't clearly communicate to you are the ones that, unfortunately, just leave you mixed. And sometimes, there, there was this one time I got, like, I felt like I got strung along. Um... Yeah, it sucks, man. Like, I know they're doing it for comedic effect, but... Damn. You're awful! <laughs> the preceding joke was brought to you by men. Men. Oh, man. We don't know what we did. 9-11 changed Again. everything, Brian. 9-11 changed everything. Peter, you didn't even know what 9-11 was until 2004. That's not true, Hello? Brian. I remember 9-11. <laughs> Must have been a woman pilot, eh? Come on, guys. We don't have to make such a big thing about it. It's not like Jesus. a woman is about to turn Lo 30. You guys, I don't care what we do for my birthday as long as it lasts the whole week and it's very expensive and inconvenient for all my friends. Oh, and I'm going to dress like a Damn. slut and be rude to everyone for no reason. Okay. But, Maya, I don't care that your dad's dying. We're all going to Montreal for the week. What a... Jesus, man. She's, She's a douchebag. Not like 37-year-old woman on a blind date fund. I mean, so what if you forgot your wallet? I'll pay. I'm going to pay oh. for us. You'll oh, I, I get it. Because she's... Time, yeah. You know. So you were in prison, right? Killed a man? Oh, I'm sure it was in self-defense. She's desperate no, because I just felt like she's running out of eggs, Mike. <laughs> oh, you tell the best stories. <laughs> Me and my three eggs are having the best time. Okay, she so doesn't look that old, to be fair. Right now, you're a 40-year-old woman with a good body in a hotel pool. Hey, everybody, look at me. I work out seven days a week for these five minutes. Your attention is going <laughs> to keep me from swallowing a bottle of pills. You listen to me, you son oh, of a damn. bitch. I've got one Wait, thing in this lifetime. One thing. <laughs> you always Groceries? say I never do anything around here. Low? Yeah, I like Just because he did the shop. I like you doing things. Dad, yeah, I got the rest from the car. We Chris, run! You were right. She didn't appreciate it. Oh crap! Ow! That's 
right. I do groceries. Yeah, mom, you get crazy when you're Can't mess with the woman of the house, man. <laughs> Jesus. Is that legit? Like, I know hormones go crazy, but is that it? Is that a legit Our society is doomed. response? People and technology are a bad match, just like moms and Radiohead. Oh, no. No, no, this isn't music. <laughs> no, I don't like this, David. So you know what? To be fair, sometimes I'm like that. Like, I'm not against rap here. I do listen to some rap songs, but... Uh... Occasionally, when I listen to something, I'm like, nah, 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 this ain't, nah, this ain't music. And then, objectively speaking, I don't know what I'm talking about. It's just my preference. It, no, that's enough. No, David, I don't like that. No. Well, it's a nice <laughs> apartment you have. Is this your dog? Yes. Isn't he the cutest little cutie wooty? You know, that's what I always is. wonder. Yes, he's very cute. Yes, he's cute. Yes, he's cute. Do, do, uh, sorry for pausing too much, by the way. I, I just... I think because I have a lot to say, and this is enjoyable anyway. Um, do would people buy dogs or own dogs or love dogs if they just weren't as cute? Now I know that sounds really messed up, but I do think about it. a lot of dogs are cute. But I just wonder if if it was a really ugly dog and dogs just in general were ugly looking, would people care? I think it's debatable. People in the half heart would say, uh, they would try to say, no, of course, I, I'd love dogs no matter what. They have personalities, etc., etc. Um, I would like to think that's true, but... <laughs> I think, like, the first thing people do is say dogs are cute. Look at him, look at him, look at him. <laughs> okay. Look at him, look at that face! Jesus. Look at that face, you look at him, look at that face! Oh, we don't need a map, Brian. I got us a GPMS machine. Go up. Lol. What do you think? Just go up. Sorry. Okay, can everyone just stop freaking out and just give me like yeah. two minutes? Come I mean, on. that was legit good direction, <laughs> though. yelling at me. What are, all the questions. All right, well, maybe we'll turn you on later and see how you feel. Hello? Was that a sex joke? Oh, it's, it's a girl. May I speak to the man of the house? This is the Lol. woman of the house, and there is no man living here. No? Damn. <laughs> what, what is... I, I, how are you paying for this phone? I'm a lawyer. Oh, I see. And are you in your little courthouse right now, representing Barbie? Hey, he That's did not just say that. You know, like when a woman in a Porsche Cayenne isn't a complete bitch. Okay. Oh. oh. Well, I did not expect that. I wasn't telling freak. you to go. I was trying to smell my own fart. Uh, she sounds like an uptight middle class woman. <laughs> Peter, you let the flap open. Like a thousand degrees in here, Lois. Close the <laughs> window, what? it's freezing. Headline, you know, woman cold. Uh, I shouldn't say it. Why do women have boobs? So you got something to look at while you're talking to them. <laughs> oh my gosh. So you got something to look at while you're talking to But he's not even looking. <laughs> so you got okay, well. You, uh, you wanted to see me, Mr. Weed? <laughs> Irrational and emotionally fragile by nature, <laughs> female co-workers are a peculiar animal. You know, they're very insecure about their appearance. They're, sure they're part of the workforce they look now. Every day, even if they're homely and uncanny. Transform You're this into like job, YouTube's Muriel, headquarters. And you're prettier than Mamie Van Doren. God, this place officially sucks worse than the WNBA. And at the top of the second half, it's 16 to 9. Easton leads the scoring with four. And that's why she commands I mean, I don't watch basketball, sure but I do watch football. Soccer. This minor um, skill worth being so unattractive? I've that's never really been to persuaded to watch female Barry football. Was over last night and he, don't tell me. He I don't know. Not to say oh, they can't play. You can see they can play. It's but... funny. He fought in Vietnam. He's an exorcist. But there is one thing that terrifies him. Commitment. Oh, oh my gosh. The canned laughter. In the whole world. Third. Who are the first two? Ben and Jerry. <laughs> I think I've had that like... Oh, it ended. I've had it like once, Ben and Jerry. But that's it. That reaction. I mean... I love Family Guy. You know I love Family Guy. I think pretty much everyone loves Family Guy. I haven't watched South Park as much. I know they're a bit more grimmer, more explicit and uh, darker with their humour. 
but Family Guy, Family Guy is like family friendly in a weird sense. It's got that dark um, sort of explicit humor, but it's also got relatable, funny in jokes and innuendos, which I do enjoy. And it was roasting every woman. Now, I mean, you a lot of it is just roasting people because if you think about it you can apply it to some anyone um but like it is interesting to know how you know we don't know what we did kind of thing sometimes that is genuinely how i feel now i, I made a post on my instagram by the way if you want to follow my instagram it's in the description um where basically um i'm in that moral dilemma of whether i should stare at you i.e a woman or not when I'm down the street or something because on the one hand I do if I think you're attractive yeah I do look at you if I uh, if I don't look at you though in some weird way it may uh, decline your value it shouldn't be that way but sometimes yeah when we want attention and someone doesn't give it it does devalue us in a way so if I don't look at her she might think why isn't he looking at me now I, of course I'm not a prize okay but you know what I mean, and I feel bad either way. If I, because if I do look, by the way, she's got a million guys looking at her, and it kind of feels she feels cheapened in some way. But if I don't look at her, she may feel cheapened too, because I don't value her enough to give a stare. But anyway, that that's my two cents. But yeah, if you want to see more Family Guy reactions, please like, subscribe, and share, because. Firstly, it's free, and secondly, it helps me up a lot because I need to get in the YouTube algorithms. Yeah, I need more people to see it. And if you want me to make more videos, I need you guys to participate in this journey with me. All right, bless you, much love, and peace.